Five years ago, the Avengers paraded dangerous, untested technology causing damage on an unprecedented scale. Our beloved Captain America was killed during the attempted theft of this technology. Thousands of other innocent people died, and many more still bear the scars of what has come to be known as A-Day. Hundreds fell sick, encased in strange cocoons, only to emerge with dangerous, otherworldly powers. With no known cure, the disease has spread across the country, and while both S.H.I.E.L.D. and the Avengers promised to rectify the situation, it was Dr. Banner's testimony that brought about the end of an era. You so-called heroes transformed San Francisco into an infectious, gas-filled quarantine zone. You unleashed disease, powerful beings that wreak havoc throughout our nation. Many still lay dormant, unidentified. So I ask you again, Dr. Banner, do the Avengers pose a danger to society? Yes. Their activities outlawed, the once mighty heroes disbanded. But out of tragedy is born hope. After the government liquidation of Stark Industries, Dr. George Tarleton, himself a victim of A-Day and founder of Advanced Idea Mechanics, thinks science is the solution to our nation's problems. I wish I knew what happened to Captain Rogers that day, but I was nowhere near the reactor room. I don't have those answers, but I can promise you this. I will use this second chance to make you safe. AIM will find a cure for the inhuman disease. This place is more than I ever imagined. Oh, hey, Banner's buddy. You got a sec? You're the portal guy. That would be me. Theo the portal guy at your service. I'm Kamala. Your powers are awesome. Oh, thanks, but you should talk to Sarah. She's up ahead next to the big surveillance screen and is dying to meet you. Me? Okay. Welcome to the Ant Hill, our little home of misfits. Hey, Avenger! Hi, you're Pim's desert crawling friend. Did Ames send you here to spy on us? What? No. I'm kidding. I've got cameras and a bunch of those dead mechs you passed in the desert. It was pretty fun watching you kick watchdog butt. Oh, thanks. I'm Sarah Garza, and the whispers about you are already fierce. Good whispers? Hell yeah, we want you on our team. You ever have spare cycles? I've got plenty that needs doing. You think this is doable? You are a lifesaver. Could you check out that chest behind you? Just got a fancy new shipment in and haven't had time to ogle it yet. Sure thing. I don't know what this is, but I bet Sarah will be excited about it. Uh, need some help over here. Ah, exactly what the doctor ordered. Thanks a bunch. No problem. Happy to help. Want to know a secret? The robots around here are all Pim's pet projects. We've got the first Mark I hanging out in the gear shack next to the stairs. Literally. He's hard to miss. Okay. Guess I can go take a look. Of Greetings, first-time customer. Do you require my services? Uh, sorry, sorry. I I'm staring. Sorry. I have no feelings regarding your ocular direction. Every trace of my past has been erased for security purposes. Oh, that's kind of... sad. My programming deemed it inefficient to be attached to such redundancies. I only receive joy through mutual transaction. So, the more I buy, the happier you get? Correct. May I be of assistance? Please, don't tell anyone I wasn't of use to you. Psst, don't freak out, but Dr. Maddie Cho wants to see you in her office. Oh, uh, what? Dr. Maddie Cho is me. Drop by the lab. I'll hook you up with some goodies. Hello there. Dang, look at you. I am liking the whole vibe. 
I'm Maddie, resident bio genius. Don't tell Pim I said that. Or Banner. Secret safe with me. You called me to your office? Yes, though I am not an inhuman, I am a purveyor of goodies, gear, and gadgets. If you need anything to make you faster, stronger, or stretchier, I'm your gal. What do you get out of it? Being smarter than everybody else. Bring me the right materials, and I'll build you gear to make AIM weep. I've already got some prototypes. Take a look. Hey. I'm in awe. Uh, I might be drooling. Can I help you with any of this stuff? Not right this minute. But you could help Pimsy with a little zinger. Check out the war table. He'll fill you in. War table it is. No go? All right. Fine. I think it's time to show AIM what I can really do. What do you think, Jarvis? I think you can accomplish anything you set your mind to, Miss Khan. Okay, now that we've got some muscle on our side, I think we should hit one of AIM's testing labs. We know they've been experimenting on inhumans in small rural communities. I'd like to get my hands on whatever research they've been collecting. Sounds good. We crashed one of their big labs in the Pacific Northwest. Olympia Archive? Impressive. We wondered who was responsible for taking that place down. Thanks. We didn't get out with a lot of information, but now maybe we can find out more. AIM has been setting up bases in small towns throughout the rural west. We suspect they've been using these as testing labs and capturing the local inhuman populace for their experiments. I can't believe all this has been happening right under the government's nose. Well, they have a lot of power in Washington and financial connections to every major corporation. AIM has had five years to set down their roots. Taking them down is not going to be easy. Well, we got to start somewhere. It's up to us to do the right thing. <laughs> Spoken like another Avenger I once knew. Welcome to Venture Ridge, Wyoming. This was one of AIM's go-to holding sites for Inhumans before the prison was built. After they moved in, most of the residents were evacuated. Got it. Keep an eye out for AIM patrols. They won't take kindly to your presence. With any luck, we'll be able to capture intel that could shed some light on what they've been doing to your people. I've marked the facility on your HUD. Thank you for doing this. Least I can do. You guys kept me going when things seemed hopeless. Just knowing the resistance was out there meant we had a chance. The odds finally seem to be tipping in our favor. You're going down! A for Good. Someone to hit. find something to prove AIM is hurting in humans? AIM keeps their data well guarded. We haven't been able to get anything solid. We just have the word of the inhumans. And I'm afraid that's not enough. Okay, I think that was all of them for the time being. So you've been building the resistance in secret all these years? Not intentionally. At least not in the beginning. A lot of us were captured by AIM early on. After we realized nobody was coming for us, we broke out and started making our own plans.
Let's do this! AIM has initiated emergency procedures. like they welcome visitors. I'm giving them a bad review. You'll need to take out the security node. That did not go as planned. What do we do? If you destroy the two transformers on the upper level, the elevator doors should open. Get in there. So you were a prisoner too? Why'd they capture you if you aren't inhuman? According to Tarleton, anyone with powers is a threat. They made sure I'll never use mine again. Altered my physiology so if I change size, I'll die. I'm so sorry. Where to? Records show a secure lab at the end of this hallway. An AIM equipment storage cache is nearby. It might be worth exploring. AIM's network. They're hiding something. Stand by and see to the AIM forces. Oh, they'll get seen too. Please work fast, Jarvis. As fast as my processor allows, sir. <laughs>
intends to physically remove some kind of research samples from their experiments. An automated transport ship is preparing for takeoff. Whatever's on that transport, I want it captured. Get to it before it leaves. I'm bypassing their security now. Stand by. How do we stop that thing taking off? I don't know if we can, but I could attempt to divert the transport from its intended destination. Excellent idea. See if you can reprogram its destination to the anthill. Looks like we made it just in time. Get close to those terminals so I can infiltrate their network. We must control all three to override the transport's navigation systems. Be on guard. AIM will try to regain control of the terminal. We just blew up an access point. Return it to our control. control of an access point. AIM has regained control of a terminal. Please deal with it. lost an access point. Return it to our control. An aim unit took back control of an access point. an access point. Return it to our control. Uh. An aim unit took back control of an... It's taking off! Jarvis, tell me you got it. Yes, sir. With 0.4 seconds to spare. The transport should be arriving at the anthill within the hour. Excellent work, everyone. Head back here and we'll begin digging through those AIM research samples. An AIM unit... Well, that didn't go quite according to plan. We've got some valuable research samples, but AIM is far more powerful than I had anticipated. And they've got so many of my people. We have to stop them. Agreed, Kamala, but we need some time to regroup. When Tony gets here with the Chimera, we'll be in a much better position to go on the offensive. Okay, but we can't wait too much longer. Okay, head back to the anthill and we'll talk about next steps. Mads, can you swing by the lab real quick? Sure. Uh, be there in a sec. Oh 
my god, hi. What's going on? I heard what happened with the dropship. They just wanted to give you something. Oh my god, hi. I don't deserve this. Yeah, the resistance uh, disagrees vehemently. Thank you. Uh, that does not sound good. Fire powers? That's intense. Powers. Oh. I mean, <laughs> they look awesome. Um, I'm a polymorph, I think. It's cool. It's like, like stretchy arms and stuff. Uh, still working on making it not look goofy, but. You're inhuman. Yeah. So what's your name? Dante. Kamala. Hey, what happened? I broke my leg during the escape. Well, at least you made it out, right? My mom came back for me. Yeah, I made it out. And she was captured. Well... The Avengers are on the way here in a couple days, okay? They're gonna take back the prison and your mom's gonna be fine, believe A couple believe days? It. Why isn't anyone listening to me? I overheard Dr. Pym. They're moving all the prisoners to a new location. Well, uh, they'll find that too. God, no, they won't. Your Avengers will be too late. Here, let me help uh, you. No. Don't you get it? We're inhuman. No one cares about us. That's not true. I've got to tell Bruce. We could do something. to convince Bruce and Dr. Pym to go back to the prison. Roy, I need you to send one of your disposable chassis to the Camaro with a few supplies. And Roy, stealth will be key. Right away, Doctor. I'm gonna say it. It's, it's just genius. Hey, you got a sec? Yeah, 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 what's up? AIM's moving the Inhumans to a more secure location. Soon. Okay. You've been talking to Dante? Uh, I'm sorry, who, who's Dante? One of our Inhuman survivors. We were able to get him out, but his mother is still inside. And our escape caused AIM to shore up security. Gotcha. Look, we have to help them. Ooh, that's not a good idea. What? There's Inhumans in there. I don't understand. Dante's we, mom. We I can't just sit know, around and do can't. nothing. We're not going to sit around and do nothing, okay? Roy just left with the energy cores. It means Tony's going to be here in less than a day. We need to wait. I don't understand. We have the Hulk. Mala, the Resistance has been trying to infiltrate that facility for months. Getting out was far easier than getting in, and we, we had help. From the ground, its walls are nearly impenetrable. You saw what we did back there. I could help. But it's too risky. You want to help? You don't There's understand. You're not inhuman. You're not ready. I'm sorry. We wait.
Sorry, I can't just... I can't do nothing. Sleep. True. I see. I shall inform Dr. Pym. Uh, could you not? All right. Good evening. Would you care to socialize? It is a beautiful night, is it not? is on shift. Uh, thanks. Hey, Kamala. You still up this late? Yeah, I... was going to lie, but I'm going to the prison. They wouldn't be moving those prisoners if it wasn't for us. Respect. Right this way. Really? Just like that? I've got a good feeling about you, but you're gonna need this. It's not safe out there. Thanks, Theo. Those inhumans need our help. If this works, then all's forgiven. I hope. I'll be back before Bruce even knows I was gone. This is the real deal. Just keep it together. Get to the cells. Free the inhumans. Piece of cake. Hmm. Cake. Big yellow door. Screams way into me. Just get these open, and I'm in. Can we just... You never saw me.
Keep coming. The terms of our agreement were clear. We deliver a cure. You control the media. And we more than held up our end, but this cure of yours? Children being ripped away from their families? People missing? <laughs> Even my resources have their limits. The public needs answers. I'm giving you something better. The launch of the Adaptoids will be the perfect distraction. <clears throat> and after? Without proof that your cure works, words like terrorism are being bandied about in some of my circles. Oh, it will work, Senator. I have the utmost confidence in Dr. Rappuccini's abilities. How much of that was a lie? The effect of the gas is still only temporary. And without my formula to keep them alive, well, the gas... Kills them. This isn't working! That gas gave us the adaptoid. My formula kept you alive. Now if I could isolate how it manifests within the Inhumans, I know I can reverse the effects. There are more opportunities here. We have enough powers harvested to build your army. It's time we cut our losses. Shut it down.